So joining us is the actress who plays the witch, Cherish Love Robinson. Welcome to the show, Cherish. Thank you so much. I'm so happy to be here. Yes, and so for those not familiar with Into the Woods, I mean, tell us a little bit about the story. It is a story about how all of these fairy tales come together and why they ended up in the woods. And so you have uh, the baker, the baker's wife, you have the witch, Rapunzel, you've got Jack, uh, Jack's mother, the beanstalk, all those fun fairy tales that we grew up uh, listening to. And uh, it's, it's kind of a culmination of how they ended up in the woods and their backstories and their relationships together, so. I love it. And you're from Dallas. You're performing here. What is it like to be able to put on this production, of course, uh, and for your hometown? I am so proud to be here from Dallas. I love it. I love my city. I love my town. Um, we have some of the most creative people here in Dallas. I mean, every time I walk into the room for rehearsal, I just, I say to myself, I'm just super lucky. I'm super lucky and blessed uh, to be here. But it is, it's amazing being from Dallas, working with these awesome Dallas artists as well. And you know, Cherish, we were actually looking at some of the rehearsal video. It looks like the troupe is having so much fun. This is the first Sondheim work that's produced by Dallas Theater, uh, by Dallas Theater Center. So, I mean, right. what is it like being a part of that history? During Women's History Month, it is amazing. <laughs> I I didn't even know that we were uh, that this was the first Sondheim work that Dallas Theater Center has put on, but it is. It's fantastic. We are having a ball. We're having a blast with it. I am a, I'm a huge fan of Sondheim's work. Huge. This is actually one of my top five roles that I've ever wanted. And so to do this here again in my hometown, it's, it's a dream come true. I love it. And Cherish, we're obviously seeing you right here in time, in real, uh, in person. We also have a picture of your costume and your getup. Can we, can we get that up right now? I love this. Because oh, the witch yeah. is this juicy role, uh, your <laughs> costume, your your wig, they look amazing. How does that help get into character for you? Immensely. So that was the first time, the video that you guys are seeing right now, that was the first time I had ever put on any of the items. I had been to a few uh, costume, you know, try on things. I had been to a few of those and they got measurements and everything. But that was the first time for the promo pictures that I had been in everything. So as soon as I put it on, the voice magically came, obviously. <laughs> um, the, a big shout out to the hair makeup team, uh, Michael, uh, Tiana, uh, Nick. Oh man, they are incredibly amazing. Tania, I'm sorry, not Tiana. Tania, she was absolutely amazing. The um, prosthetics that they put on my nose, the moles, it, a work of art, truly. Absolutely. And we know from, of course, Into the Woods, but West Side Story, you've got Gypsy. The vocal demands are high with Sondheim. Did you welcome that challenge? What was that like? I, did I welcome the chal challenge? Am I welcoming the challenge? Yeah. That's, that's actually <laughs> happening right now. I started, as soon as I was offered the role, I kind of started conditioning my voice to bring this role on. Um, I started learning the music, figuring out what I wanted to do. It is a a huge challenge that to take on any of Sondheim's music because it goes so fast, especially this musical. So I, I did a lot of studying, am doing a lot of studying because uh, even when it's on its feet, it feels different than when you're, you know, singing in the car uh, or jamming, you know, with some of the other co-workers and things like that. So it yes. feels intensely different when you put it on stage. Um, but again, it's 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 a huge challenge, but I was ready. I'm ready. <laughs> I, I love how humble you are with this because you are a vocal coach and your work has been on Grey's Anatomy. So that is incredible. Another reason why you should go see this. Into the Woods opens Friday, April 7th, and we just can't thank you enough for coming on, Cherish. So this, thank by the you. way, is running through the end of the month at the mm -hmm. Wiley Theater in the Dallas Arts District. So for ticket information, all you gotta do is go to dallastheatercenter.org. And this, uh, this will be a popular one for sure.